Okay, so you need to open a PTX file. It's very easy. I'm going to show you how to do it very quickly. First of all, if, if you got a PTX file, I'm going to take a guess that you're an attorney, a legal secretary, or maybe you're a client working with an attorney because these are usually uh, transcript files. Um, and the PTX extension, um, these particular transcripts were saved in the PTX format, which um, is produced by Real Leaguer eTranscript. And to open these, what we're going to do is download the free viewer for this file type. And that would be the Real Legal eTranscript bundle viewer. All right, so um, the first step is to install the viewer. So I'm going to head over to a web page. If you didn't know it, you can always um, click on start and type the web page you want to go to right here. And I'm going to reallegal.com. All right. Once you uh, pull up reallegal.com, you're going to notice it redirects you to legal solutions at the root of thomasreuters.com uh, domain. And that's because Westlaw and Thomas Reuters has acquired this particular software. All right, but we just want to get the viewer. So we're going to click on software downloads. And then we're going to click on eTranscript Viewer. All right, once you come to this page, you're going to see a button that says Proceed with Download. It's about 30 megabytes, um, and it will download as quick depending on the speed of your computer. All right, and I'll also bring to your attention that they have customer and technical support. Um, if you have any technical problems with this viewer, they have um, you can call 800-290-9378. They're available Monday through Friday from 6.30 a.m. 7.30 p.m., which is good because attorneys work long hours, and that's central time. Or you can shoot an email to this address, Westlaw Software Support at thomasreuters.com. All right, so once you have this particular file downloaded, and most browsers will throw it into your downloads folder on your computer. You want to go ahead and install it. Once your software is installed, your files will probably look like this, like mine do on my desktop. Um, if, but more than likely, you receive the file as an email attachment. You can just double click the attachment and it will open up in Real Transcript Viewer. So I'm going to open up one right here just to show you what it looks like. This is just a random one that I found off the internet. All right, and there you have it. That's how you open a PTX file on a Windows PC. This is June from junesjournal.com. Have a great day.